All right, we have the Joe Madden with us from the Hazleton area. Joe, thanks again. As uh, I know you're in the season, so I appreciate the time here on SSP TV to talk about this event, this Peace Love Chalk. Mm. Um, your involvement with this, is this something that your foundation has supported? Of course, um, it's something I've been wanting to do for years. I'm in Long Beach right now, right down the street. It's uh, Second Street. It's a very cool area here in Belmont Shore. And that's where I first saw it. Um, they have the, the artists drawing on the sidewalks there. That's at least 10 or 15 years ago. So I brought it back, talked to Carmine about it. And I thought it'd be very uh, beneficial to the area to really promote the arts, uh, to get more kids involved, young people involved. I still, it's still growing. And I, and I really do envision as we continue to make our hometown better, and, and more uh, prosperous that you're going to see more of this back there. So it's just, the arts are such a big part of any culture and, and, and uh, a thriving culture uh, trying to get back on your feet. So I thought it was really uh, a natural. This year is going to be the sixth annual event mm. that's held here in Hazleton during the, the Fun Fest weekend. Right. Yeah, it's great. Um, I, I love it. I wish, I wish in a weird way, because if I was there, that means I'm not doing my baseball thing. So <laughs> uh, I'll take a couple more years of doing this and then get back there to actually watch it in person. But I'm hoping that the people back there are really um, catching on to it and understanding uh, why it's so important to the area to, to really get involved in the arts. It's, it's arts in and of itself is going to attract uh, the kind of culture you're looking to build in any community. And so I, I know the, the art center downtown is becoming way more prosperous. We had our event there last year, beautiful uh, building, how it's being set up right there. And I think the involvement has in, increased there too. It's just a, it's an interconnected kind of a situation with the uh, Peace, Love and Chalk to try to get, bring, bring the uh, level of awareness up a little bit higher. And again, just to promote the arts back home. So this is an event that's grown in this area, but as mm -hmm. you said, you've seen this around for 12, 15 years. Yeah, I've seen it here in, in uh, California. I wanted to bring it to Chicago. And actually, I, I was real close to having somebody um, uh, to do it on Michigan Avenue. I thought it'd be a no-brainer back there, too. Um, you know, I did the thing a couple years ago with the different pieces of art um, that we did. I mean, it's artists from Tampa, uh, Jason Skeldon, and, and uh, we did nine pieces. And it was just, just a gradual thing. Art never really loses its flavor, I don't think. And this is something that can come back. Um, so, uh, yeah, it's, I've seen it in other places, but I mean, Hazleton, uh, this, this small quaint little community, like little niche place, if we could get it rocking and rolling back there, you got Jim Thorpe down the street. Um, uh, why not, why not really start getting to the point where uh, people are attracted to our hometown, uh, for a lot of great reasons. And one of them would be uh, a really well-developed art program. Art is something uh, that has no boundaries when it comes to age, when it comes to language, when it comes to, you know, your background. So it's something that everyone could unite around. We're all artists. Every one of us has a, a piece of that within us. Um, it can be actually drawing. It could be musical. Uh, it can be gardening. It can be a lot of different things that, that we could uh, uh, develop and display our uh, inner art artist. Um, I, I, I absolutely believe that. Uh, I'm, I'm into all those different things. Um, I, I would, I, I think it'd be great to really encourage the youth around our hometown to uh, really uh, permit themselves to um, demonstrate their inner artist. Um, and like I said, every one of us have that, has that. So it's a, it's a great way uh, for self-expression. And the more we promote it and you get people outside of their comfort zones to and really, that's what you really need to do. Do you get that, that comfort zone thing? It's a bad place to exist. Get out of it. Uh, get out of it as quickly as you possibly can. Very good. <clears throat> well, I thank you for your time here on SSP TV. As always, you're invited on any time. We hope to see you in person here in good old Hazleton soon. <laughs> we'll be back. Uh, Jay and I will be back uh, at the end of the season. I'll drive the RV back there when we get that opportunity. But thanks for having us on today. Thanks for promoting Peace, Love, and Chalk. 